Miller, and it's currently on at the Market Theatre in Johannesburg. Now, this piece celebrates women who have endured discrimination, uh, hardships in their lives, and is performed by one of South Africa's most renowned dancers, Sun Boy Mudao, and Confined also features uh, the Vuyani Dance Company dancers, as well as popular a cappella group Complete. And to tell us more about the production, we are joined in studio by Lulum Langeni, as well as Sun Boy Mudao. A very good morning to you too, and welcome to Morning Live. Thank you morning. for having us. Good morning. Lulu, I'm going I'm to start with you. Now, Confined is inspired by the life of uh, Winamatigizela Mandela. How did that come about? Um, I think it all began when I started reading um, um, her book, uh, 491 Days, yeah. um, that actually propelled me to, to take this direction. Um, and yeah, and other life experiences as well, because I've had a lot of conversations with different women's, uh, women. Yeah. Um, and yeah. Yeah, and so, so board for you, how did it come about? Just brief as more. Uh, yeah, it, this work, it's, it's Lulu's concept. It's, it's Lulu's work. So okay. I, uh, yeah, I was invited to become one of the dancers within the work. And yeah. So how did the collaboration between the two of you come about? Uh, we've, we, we started collaborating um, last year yes, when yeah. we did Big City, Big Dreams. Oh, um, okay. It was a collaboration between the three dance major companies in Johannesburg. Uh, Vianney Dance Theatre, Moving Into Dance and Chobek Ballet. Yeah. And that's where our relationship actually started yeah. uh, to work together. Okay, in this production, uh, the lives of women or, or the hardships that they endure comes under the spotlight. So what are some of the issues that are tackled in there? Sure, there's quite a lot. There's a number of issues. Uh, we, we're tackling social violence, we're tackling patriarchy, uh, we're tackling power. Uh, dominion, you know, you name it. Um, and also, I, I don't want to box it in a sense that um, it's only about female. And also, it's one of the things that I discovered last night after the performance. Mm. Um, that actually, we are dealing with women, um, men as well, uh, who are going through a lot of abuse out there, but they're not coming out. Um, you know, they're not talking about these things. They keep it to themselves. So it's actually not about only women. It's, it's, it's about everyone. Mm. And yeah. having been part of this production, uh, what can you say should be done in order to tackle such issues uh, as you just mentioned that, you know, we box things within ourselves and we don't, uh, you know, we don't talk about them? Yeah, yeah, yeah. For me, I think it's mostly uh, uh, what, what I have learned from this work. It's, uh, this work, it's, it's a work that opens dialogue and which is something mm. that we, we sort of missing within our communities. Like we are afraid to, to, voice out, to voice out or to speak about things that affect yeah. us, whether it's at home or at work. But now uh, with this work, it's, uh, we are sort of opening this kind of so that people can start opening, uh, opening up, talking about these issues that are affecting us and okay. not being afraid to say, this is what is happening to me and I need help in terms of getting out of this situation or yeah. finding myself as a person, yeah. Sure. Yeah. What can we really do about that? Because we know there's the issue, there's a the situation, but then I'm just looking at it from a distance. What can we do to tackle those issues head on? I mean, um, the fact that we, uh, we've got platforms like um, Market Theatre uh, who are giving us the space to actually voice out these issues. Absolutely. And, and, and also communicate to the world out there. You know, um, um, we have to start somewhere. For sure. You know, For they, sure. Um, we can't just say, okay, they, they'll be done or we have to take this direction. Somebody's got to do but it. But somebody's got to do something. Yeah. And we're trying to do that through movement, uh, through body movement. Um, and also through text, uh, through music, you know, um, it, 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 it differs. Yeah. Yeah. So after watching this production, what is it that you want your audiences to take away from it? The famous question. <laughs> 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 they always ask me that question. Um, when well, you I, have to ask it though. <laughs> I would hate to, 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 to box um, the audience or the viewers. You know, I always say, um, just come and have fun and enjoy and take whatever that you want to take uh, within the piece. You know, um, yeah. you don't know how it, it might touch you as an individual. So um, I can't dictate how people should actually react to the piece. So they must just because come and enjoy. Because we see it differently anyway. Yeah, we yeah, see it differently. We approach it differently. Yeah, and, I mean, uh, there's different lessons that we can learn. From yeah, it. but yeah. also, as I've said that last night, you know, I discovered something. So we, it's, 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 a, it's a process. It's a learning process. Every day changes, you know. Yeah. yeah. All right, Kosh, I, I, I wish you had more time, but unfortunately <laughs> we have to end it there. Thank you guys for coming through. No, thank I you really for appreciate us. it. That was uh, Lulum Langene and Sanipoi Mudao talking to us about the dance production Confined, which is currently taking place at the Market Theatre in Johannesburg.